On this episode, we take our son Landon, at seven months old, on his first camping trip and have a fun-filled weekend, fishing, pedal boating, riding the super tube and relaxing in the hot water pools, as well as a bit of bird watching. I'm Andre Herbert, and this is my wife Aurea and our son Landon. Welcome back to all our subscribers and a warm welcome if it's your first time watching one of our videos. If you're new to our channel, we are positive that by the end of this video, you would have subscribed, which is free by the way, and become part of our YouTube family called At Cape Town. And hopefully we can inspire you to get out there and embrace the wonderful places our city has to offer. That said, on this episode, we camp at the most requested campsite our viewers asked us to review, Montague Caravan Park. On the scenic Route 62 in the Little Karoo, in the small farming community of Montague, situated about halfway between Cape Town and Oatshorn. From Cape Town, we travel in the easterly direction on the N1 and then the R62, which leads you all the way to Montague. As you enter the town, turn left into Rose Street, and at the T junction, take another left into Bath Street, and that will take you straight to the campsite's reception office. We travelled from Brackenfell and it was a total of 160 kilometers to the entrance and it took us about 2 hours. The road is tarred all the way so this campsite can be easily accessed by any vehicle, even if towing a road caravan. You'll need to make a quick stop at reception. If you have a short fuse or are easily offended, rather avoid this section and send your better half in to sort out the paperwork and to make any final payments. In our opinion, the front desk staff don't have the best customer relations skills and it could be improved on. Just a note, only cash is accepted at the office. Remotes for the gate can be hired if you need 24 hour access to the park. This campsite has a whole list of rules that get strictly enforced for everyone's enjoyment. We'll leave a list of the rules in the description section of this video so you at least know what you're in for. Camping is charged per person and pensioner rates are available on request. They also run 5 and 7 day specials out of season, but this isn't advertised. Long term camping is also available on request. Motorhomes, caravans and tents are all welcome, as well as motorcycles. And you'll have a choice of 82 demarcated sites. Some are more suitable for caravans as they have paved sections. All the sites have electricity points and built bries that come with a chopping log, but you'll need your own grids. There are water points and refuse bins to share between every two campsites. This park has quite a festive feel to it on most weekends. The campsite has lighting on all the footpaths and at the ablution buildings, but you'll need some sort of lighting to lighten up your plot. Montague Caravan Park will welcome your smaller breed furry friends. Simply make prior arrangements, and as long as they are on a leash, they are welcome. This offer is unfortunately only for camping, and not if you're booking into one of the self-catering cottages. Music is prohibited throughout the campsite. All the major network cell phone carrier signal is good throughout the campsite. The various communal ablutions are mostly unisex, and impeccably clean and fitted with showers that are hot courtesy of gas geysers so you'll have hot water 24 hours a day, hand basins with mirrors as well as flush toilets and toilet paper is supplied but does run out from time to time. The ablutions at the office has a bath and are designed to make it easily accessible for people with mobility impairments and it has a porta potty disposal section.
scullery areas with hot and cold water are available at most of the ablution buildings. There are a total of three swimming pool areas in the campsite. The first is an indoor heated pool that is child friendly with pool lounges positioned around the pool. This area is open from 9 in the morning until 8 at night. Then there's a fenced outdoor cold water pool with a small super tube that is very popular with the kids and a toddler pool in the same area. Here you'll find mostly grass and a bit of paving around the pools. And they have three thatched pergolas and a few pool lounges available that work on a first come first serve basis. There's also a toilet available in the pool area. The super tube runs between 10 in the morning and 1 in the afternoon. And then again in the afternoon between 4 and 5.30. Then there's a small indoor heated pool for people over 20 years of age that's open between 9 in the morning and 8 at night. Behind the cold pool is where the miniature horses reside and they don't mind if you feed them an apple or two. Self-catering chalets, luxury backpackers and wooden huts are also option at Montague Caravan Park which vary in size but mostly accommodate four guests all with bedding supplied and an outside briar area but you'll need to bring your own bry grid and in some cases your own towels. Some of the units have air conditioning available for added comfort. Just a note, no pets are allowed in any of the self-catering units. On site you'll find a tuck shop that sells ice creams, chips, sweets, chocolates, wood and ice, as well as hot chips and sandwiches as takeaways. However, take a drive into town and you'll have quite a few shops and restaurants to choose from, including a spa and a tops. The campsite has an unfenced dam for fishing, stocked with carp and tilapia, and they work on a catch and release basis. There is some shade around the dam, but remember an umbrella just in case you don't manage to get a shady spot. Just something to look out for, there are thorn trees around the dam with some mighty big thorns, so just warn the kids. Paddle boats are for hire and tickets can be purchased at the office. The boats could do with a bit of TLC as the age is showing, but they're still fun all the same.
If you just want to relax, then take your partner on a walk around the dam and sit on one of the various benches while watching the abundant natural bird life doing their daily chores and whispering sweet nothings into your partner's ear. Another great thing about this caravan park is that your kids can ride their bicycles around the resort or down to the play parks that include jungle gyms, slides and swings. There is also a TV room with DSTV for those all important sporting events and a pool table to keep the kids entertained. In the mornings you can expect a visit from the resident geese scrounging around for any food you might have dropped the night before. Montague Caravan Park has certainly got it right. The grounds are perfectly manicured and there is lots of shade from the surrounding trees and the gardens are just lovely. Thanks. Nice. Safe the journey, eh? Thanks, you guys too. Enjoy yeah, the camping. Bye. Thank you to Granny Cheryl and Grandpa Harrod for inviting us to come camping with them. It's time to say our goodbyes. We had a fantastic time here and we'll definitely be back. We can highly recommend this campsite to anyone looking to have a fun-filled weekend. This campsite is very popular, especially over the December holidays, so be sure to make a prior booking to avoid disappointment. There is also a minimum amount of days you can book for in peak season. All their contact details will be left in the description section of this video. If we hear of any changes, we will leave a comment in the comment section and pin it to the top. Next time we're going to be heading toward the town of Optiberg and camping a bit off the grid at Bali's Hut campsite. And we get introduced to their latest addition, self-catering clamping tents, secluded in the mountains in the Kauerbockefeld, just south of the Siederberg. If you found this video informative, be sure to hit that like button to show your support. You'll be surprised how many of our followers we meet and they want to know how much it costs to subscribe. Well, for those of you who don't know, it is absolutely free. And if you hit the bell icon after you've subscribed, you will be informed as soon as we upload a new video. Till next time, and remember, it's not just a mountain.